Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Fiend Folio. We are jumping in again. Let's randomize our character, see what we might get. We had a very fun run as the deleted last. Uh, very interesting one. And this time we get Forgotten. I will totally do a Forgotten run. We are on a bit of a losing streak, as is the, always the case. We haven't done Greedier as uh, Forgotten, so why not do a Greedier run as Forgotten? Seems like a good idea. Is that a new little spray art there for the uh, scene transition? That, that seemed new. Anyways, let's see what we might get. Um, I'm pretty pretty happy with a Morbid Heart plus um, plus a, a one health up. Also, it has made our character look adorable. He's not quite as skeleton-y as he once was, but he looks pretty awesome. Anyways, for the shop, uh, first of all, we get ourselves a free key, which is very nice. Um, getting free key with a free key. Uh, sadly, this one's not quite as obtainable. Um, ooh, also... Cricket's leg is a well worth purchase for us. Buddy in a box, not bad, not bad. For the question of the day to day, what is, um, let's think of a good one actually. Let's think of a good one. Let's think of a good one. What, uh, I, I've probably already asked this before, but there's always new people watching, so I'm going to ask it again. What is your favourite genre of game and why? I'm sure I've asked this before, but I feel like some, some questions of the day can be repeated just because we tend to have new people joining all the time and thank you for those that are new joining and those of you that um are maybe older viewers you can just either uh if you've answered it already you can either just ask me a question of your own or just tell me your second favorite and why <laughs> there's always room for me um I, it probably comes as no surprise that roguelikes is one of my favorites um, but I'm also quite partial to um, RPG games. Uh, I, I quite like, although I don't play many of them, I quite like racing games. Uh, as a kid, Gran Turismo used to be like my favourite game of all time. And I still get the new Gran Turismo each year. I need to get a PS5 before I get the next one though. Uh, but I try to get the new Gran Turismo whenever I can. Um, and uh, I'm going to say I absolutely love them. I think they're really good. So, I think in this situation, we're definitely going to take this first. Unfortunately, our shop is hot, stinky cat dookie. Um, it is just terrible. Uh, we'll grab this as well. Try and keep our morbid heart alive for as long as we can. I'm probably just going to skip out on buying anything on this floor. Hello, sir. I do realize, by the way, that I can switch over to the... Um, this guy's got the super fast dash. I do realize I can switch over to the uh, ghost version of myself, but... For one, ghost version has much less health. And for two, I just don't find the ghost version is enjoyable. Okay. I need to take out the, um, damn it. I need to take out the pooter. That pooter is very annoying. Thank you. Oh, dude. Okay. Don't lose my morbid heart here. That would be terrible. But as you can see, this, uh, is already paying itself forward. Because we're getting plenty of locusts. Honestly, 17% chance to get a Locust is so high. We're going to be getting them very regularly. Especially when the stuff like flies. Okay, good. We didn't lose the Morbid Heart yet. I'm very happy about that. He just blew up. I think we got an explosive fly there in the middle of all that. Okay, good. Um, I would like to maybe buy a heart, but I don't know if it... Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse me? Why? Hey, we can get a heart here. Don't worry about it. That was uh, peculiar, to say the least. Right, let's do this. We don't want Devil Deal. Actually, to be fair, we can take Devil Deal. This is Laser Pin, and it's double Laser Pin, which scares me a lot. I'm hoping we can just kind of push him away. Oh, God. I don't really know how to deal with double Laser Pin, I'm going to be honest. Okay, cool. We almost got you. Not too bad. Yeah, let's actually go for the Devil Deal, because we can we can take it. What the hell's this? Spawn a snake familiar which charges the enemies. Ooh, that sounds interesting. I don't even I didn't even get to see what mod that was from, but hey ho, we have him now. I like the idea of snake. I'm guessing it's a Fiendfolio one, just because the Fiendfolio one has that other snake, and it makes me think that it's probably from the same mod. Um, in here, we've got more HP or random. I think I'm honestly going to go for more HP. I would have got damage there, which would have been great. But honestly, more HP as the Forgotten is very, very nice. Uh, unfortunately, all of this is not great. Uh, ooh, the pile of bones is decent. The, the pile of bones isn't bad. 
Technology is fantastic for us here. We get tech burn. Um, it's a five room charge. That's that's definitely tempting because it gives us a HP up as well. I might take that. I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. It seems thematic for this character. And it seems like it could be fun. We get a, a grouping of burn spares, which is going to basically give us a little area of, of safety. And then also it can give us burn orbitals too, which is quite nice. And also these are going to stack up over time as well, remember. I lost my burn heart already. Whoops. I didn't really consider the fact that I was one hit away from losing a burn heart there. Snake Boy's doing a pretty good job, by the way. I like him. Like, look at that. That made them those enemies significantly easier. Snake Boy's in there doing his thing. This time we did get a burn orbital as well, nice. Oh god, lots of leeches. Get behind the burns, the burns will protect us from the leeches. And we got Wormwood here. Oh, what the hell? Wormwood's looking awesome. But quite tricky though. It's nice when he just doesn't want to get anywhere near us at all, so we can't attack him. It's going to be annoying when the next boss shows up, but we'll see how it goes. That guy's just stuck in all the burn spares. That's hilarious. Oh, dude. The under the ground thing is going to be tragic as this. As I've forgotten here. It pops out the wall. That's him gone, at least. You can go away with your jumping. My worm friend will take take care of you very quickly, and so he did. Good, good. Um, I think we want to try and buy a little more. I don't think that works for us, so let's try and reroll and get something better. Binky is decent. I'm going to take Binky. Just because it gives us a soul heart as well. It does decrease our swing size, which isn't great. I didn't really think about that. But honestly, swing size isn't all that for us. We do have another Wormwood here. Oh, dude, come on now. I can't kill the fly. Kill the fly, please. There you go, we got the fly. Okay, it's going to do the underground thing now. Underground thing's definitely annoying in greedier mode. Create a lot of very annoying pits. Without flight, it's a pain in the ass. What am I looking for next? Give me like a Hemalacria or something. Give me something really fun to go with technology. Yeah, nice, that's you dead. Devil Deal is now viable for us. We've got Fatal Fiend. On pickup replaces all soul and black hearts. The malt hearts. On pickup replaces all uh, red hearts. Uh... That's not that great. Uh, but then again, neither is that, really. I guess I'm just going to take this. I don't know how much of a damage up it is. Actually, that's a pretty huge damage up. Okay. Ooh. Didn't consider that as a plausibility. It has emptied all my burn hearts. I knew it would, like, replace our soul hearts. I didn't think it'd do that. That's not great. Anyways, get me out of here. That's going to be a problem. I'm going to be losing burn hearts on the regular now, which is scary. Got Ash Pit here, especially with Ash Pit. Ash Pit's going to be tough. Oh, no. That was really good. It did lower our range again, though. I'm hoping my trinket ends up sealing the deal for us here, pretty much. And really, if things get too tricky, I can just kind of leave my um, my worm friend dude to just kind of do everything for me. Which isn't the most ideal, but it could work. I hate these enemies with a burning passion. Couldn't actually kill that one. Dude, just die. 
already wasting my time. Good. Nice. I'm sad, I'm sad one of those bombs didn't end up hurting another enemy. Yeah, I like just creating like a base for my, my burns. So I've got like a little safety pen. Okay. Careful of the fart clouds. He's dead. That wasn't too bad at all. We killed him before the next boss even came up. This guy's probably going to take a burn heart off of me, if I was to guess. Especially now that there's holes in the floor that I am finding it really hard to place. I really like this, the way this guy looks, though. My god. We almost got him. Nice. We got him. Beautiful. I'm gonna I'm gonna just go for this just because I, I realize it's quite risky, but my main reasoning here is just that um there's so many burns on the floor to protect us, which I've already lost quite a few of. Um okay, that's not great. I didn't consider the fact that I can not take my devil deals now, but luckily both of them are trash. <laughs> So I don't really care. Right. Um, stop taking money off me. Secretion's pretty good here. It's not super good with our burn throwing, but it's decent. Fuck you, Penny. Some bullshit. I didn't mean to buy a key there. Fuck me. Give me enough to get 15 cent. Good. Health-wise, things ain't going so hot. And I realise this thing can explode as well, but I don't care. Damn you, Penny. Any red hearts in here for me? No, no, no. Okay, so health-wise, we ain't looking so hot. Health-wise, things are looking pretty bad. Gehenna. Ooh, this gives us spun, so I'll take that. Oh, tech 2 would have been great, though. I think secretion is something we need to be utilizing whenever possible, just because of that big red line of creep that lasts a considerable amount of time, actually. And of course, I've lost another burn heart. I might die pretty early here, like looking at my health right now. And you may be saying, Turtle, why not use your um, ghost form? Never. I'm melee only. I realize it's the reason that I'm dying, but I don't care. Ow, I didn't see you there. I'm dead. Damn it. We go again. We go again. That was a short run. I'm really bad at this game recently, but I don't really care. Uh, Roid Rage is pretty good, especially the Ranger. Quickly check this out. Nothing. We got another one of these pennies. Okay, I reckon this is the best time to take this because we have zero money. So we already got a key out of it. Oh, it's gone. Okay. We just got a key out of it. That's fine by me. Um, eh, really not great, but potentially somewhat useful. I'm really not too happy about that. We are. 
Luckily, these fights haven't been too hard. That was that guy almost got me there. He predicted where I was going to move to. But got just enough range to get those guys. So many of these is just lag. <laughs> That was good. <laughs> Managed to clear up pretty much everything without doing anything there. Right, item-wise, what do we have available to us? De all of these are trash. We're not going to be getting any of those. And we do have another syringe there, which is potentially pretty good. Remember this guy? I just want to say, remember this guy teleports now. Steven's on some new shit. And also remember he does that when he dies. Focus on the little dude for now. There you go. And then you... Getting a little bit of a double hit action here, because I'm pushing him directly into a fire. So, if you don't move, damn it, you moved. I mean, to be fair, I did, I did enough to make, make me kill you pretty quickly, so I don't mind. And then Devil Deal as well. Which is... Okay, this isn't too bad. We just fought Steven. Okay. I'd ra really rather not have two of the babies chasing me. I'm going to try and take this one out before I detach the next one. There you go. Okay. We good. We good. I could have just bombed both of those. That would have worked out pretty well. Brimstone bombs are... Um... Honestly, not a bad pickup when we've got the bomb setup that we currently have. Obviously, we're going to need more bombs to fuel that, but otherwise, not a terrible decision. Bombs aren't super easy to come by in greedy mode, so it might not end up working out super great, but we'll see. And we've got an arcade here, which is unfortunately not a great arcade for us. We do have the ability to bomb a few of those guys. Can be thrown and will spin on the floor temporarily. Any pickups, enemies, and tears touching it will be re-rolled. Interesting. Also... Not a very good room here. We're going to have to use a bomb just to get to the reroll machine. Oh, that hit the reroll machine. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, typeset's probably the thing we want from here then. I yeah, wasn't expecting that at all. Guillotine's fine as the forgotten because our burn still comes from our body. Something that I was told about in the comments. Thank you to whoever told me about that. Got a look down. I don't really care about that. You dwellers? No, you're not. Ah! What the fuck? You hit me. Regardless of the fact that it swings from my body, it's still going to confuse the absolute bejeebus out of me. Health is bad. This is a lot of these guys. Oh my god. That explosion got me. We've got a liberty cap there? Thank you. You could die, please. That'd be mighty kind. Also, it's seeming that typeset doesn't work if it's not applied to tears, which is just a fantastic waste of money. I was really hoping it would just apply on swing like a lot of other effects, but that doesn't seem to be the case, unfortunately. It seems to be on tears only. Very sad. Um, Yeah, we don't have a reroll machine anymore, so this area is kind of balked. Nothing much here I really want. I'm going to take a key. I'm going to keep going. But, yeah, not not super pleased with our run so far now. Especially, yeah, typesets really fucked me off. Oh, good. I'm going to die again. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's definitely going to kill me. I don't think I've ever no-hitted this guy. There you go, he killed me. Boy! Boy, I'm trash at this game. No, 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 no. Correction. Boy, I'm trash at the Forgotten. I suck as this guy so hard. It's embarrassing. But I enjoy playing him, so I don't mind. Uh, Mongo, baby. Not very good, but okay early on. 
Someone needs to make a mod that makes Mongo Baby actually copy whatever familiar you get next. Because right now, it doesn't. <laughs> like, at all. It copies, like, three of them and that's it. It'd be nice if he literally just... Like, like a Baby Good mimic from uh, Enter the Gungeon, where just... The next familiar that you pick up while you have Mongo Baby, it just transforms into another one of that familiar. I really think that's how it should work. He stays like this for now, and then as soon as you get another familiar, he transforms into one of them. I think that'd be a really cool redesign of Mongo Baby, because right now Mongo Baby sucks. <laughs> He's super useless. Like, he's got good damage when you don't have great damage, but otherwise, he's not very good. Oh god, there was an invisible one right in front of me that I didn't see. Okay. Oh my goodness, why? Do I suck so hard? This is why people are like, ooh, melee characters. I'm like, no, no, no. Melee characters ain't for me. I get way too aggressive. Oh, this... It took my burn height. You're supposed to die when your fucking father body piece of shit dies, you goddamn rolling head goober. What are you doing? No, thank you. I do not like. I do not like. But I will not concede. I will stay as this version of Forgotten Forever. I will not turn into the ghost version. Also, a pink version of this guy. How many dives? Four? Four dives. Yeah, four dives. Which is really annoying because he takes forever, but. I mean, can he lay red poop as well? I can never remember. Yeah. And in here we get Eye of the Occult, which I don't know if that does anything for us, but we'll see. It gives us damage at least. I almost walked into that red poop there. Right, we leave. Oh, free hugs. Oh, you gave me a red heart, you bastards. Hoping for a soul heart. But anyways, the challenge continues again. Low health, cry time. More of my curse. This is pretty good here. Breakfast is good, but, but. But we have a boss trap room here that we can currently enter. And it's for consolation prize, which I will take both of. Doesn't put my health in a great spot. Ooh, more of my curses works with the swing. Good. Luckily, we can stop that guy in his tracks. Oh, you have a stain. Okay. I wasn't quite sure what boss this was. Okay, you just keep doing that same attack, sir. That works out for me. <laughs> Great. Double consolation prize there. Very, very good. We can come in here. Grab this. Heals us up nice and good. And then, safety blanket doesn't do much for us. Can we get these? We can. Stars card, good. We just saved ourselves a bunch of keys. I think we go for some re-rolling here. Uh, I'll bomb you as well and see if you got anything for us. I do, nice one. That covers my re-roll costs. We got the burn thing again. Uh, we also got um, odd mushroom, which I think is probably worthwhile to grab. And then, yeah, let's take this as well this time. I think this increases the damage we deal to enemies. It's, it's not particularly good for, for, boss wa uh, for normal waves, but for bosses, it seems like it could be really, really good. It's also like the other candles where it recharges during waves too, which is nice. But yeah, I, I reckon we ought, we ought to just kind of ignore it for normal enemies unless it's something difficult. And we utilize it for uh, specifically for bosses. But that guy, I want to use it on. A lot of these dudes, and these dudes are pretty pertinent now. Yep, as you can see, pretty pertinent. 
It also doesn't have a lot of range. I need to consider that. Whoa. What are these guys again? Oh, these guys are the rain cloud fellas. Okay. Um... I think I want this. Euthanasia would be great. Okay, just take out the uh, the dips first, because they're, for one, pulling focus from our willows, but also just getting kind of annoying. Nice. Okay, this guy's going to be tricky. We're probably going to take some damage on him. But as you can see, a crazy amount of damage we're able to deal now is pretty awesome. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. This boss is real tough. I, I don't really know how to fight him, like, at all, so... One, two, I think it's three of those. Three, yep. Yeah. And then he does a bunch of shit. I, I just don't really know how to fight him at all. I don't know what to expect. I don't know what's coming. Yeah, he got rid of one of my burn hearts. Good for you, sir. Bunch of bubbles. Just die, you bitch. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to take anything in here, but I'll check. Yeah, not so great. Health is once again in uh, in peril. Not a big fan of this, but oh well. It hurts. It's kind of decent for us, considering we're getting hurt right now. Wyatt Co. Hangers good. Golden bomb. Can we pay? Oh, we can't pay golden bombs into that. Damn it. Okay. I don't even really know. Okay, I was just about to say, I don't even really know what those things do. Now I do. They hurt badly. Okay, we are one hit away from death again. Okay, this big John guy is going to be around the whole time now, isn't he? This is going to be pretty tricky. Oh, these guys explode now as well. I forgot about that. Oh my god. Dude, how are you not dead? My goodness. How did I survive that? Holy. Give me red health. Thank you. Right. Let's try and reroll for something a bit better. Molten Dime is amazing, but I just don't think it's the right thing for us right now. The hell's this? Item Recycler. Good. <laughs> damage and range. I guess I'll take some damage and range. That would be pretty nice. I need to remember I have golden bombs as well. I've kind of forgotten about that. Oh shit, you spawned next to me. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, what the fuck? Your shot split? I didn't know that. Oh my lord, I just hit myself a bunch of times. You fucking jump on me? What boss is this? <laughs> I don't know what boss that was. Was that Mask of Infamy? Because that is not how Mask of Infamy normally works. I'm guessing that's something to do with the rework mod. Anyways, this has been the tragic tale of Turtle Melon Plays uh, The Forgotten on Greedia Mode. I hope you guys somehow enjoyed. Um, I'm terrible at this game today. 
and I need to stop playing it because, yeah, I'm just not having very good luck. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.